Hey guys, have you heard about Dixper? Just let me show you and we'll check it out together how to set it up, everything. Just come on. So, you're all probably wondering what is Dixper? And I'm here to show you what it is right now. And this is super easy. All you gotta do is, I'm, I'm gonna sign out here just so you can see my process. So, all you gotta do is, if you're a streamer, this is. For viewers, the process is much shorter and very much easier. I will show that as well later. If you're a streamer, you press start now. It's for Windows 10 and it's gonna download the program. And after that is done, you can log in with your Twitch account like this. And mine is already logged in, so it's just gonna skip that part right now. And when you log in for the first time, you're gonna come to this screen that asks, are you a streamer or are you a viewer? And you select, you're a streamer, of course, and it will set you up with everything you need. And then, after you have done this, what you gotta do is you gotta install Dixper as we install any other software, start it up, and wait for it to open, and you will be presented with a window that looks like this. You can see here, we have some, I have, these are all, everything that's happened in my channel and not something you have to think about right now, but it's there. So first, you're gonna come into a page that says, like, choose a game that you play a lot. It's gonna look like the page I'm going into now, like this. And for me, I've chosen a couple of games, but let's say, okay, I'm gonna play Lost Ark. I think I've already added this one. Uh, so I'm just gonna go back, but otherwise you just press add. And it's gonna be added like this. It's in my collections, Lost Ark. And you can see here, force me to attack non-stop. If I check what this does, is it's gonna play this video file, attack, and then it's gonna force me to press these buttons for a couple of seconds. And I can't do anything about it. This software takes over my mouse and keyboard, and also my screen. The result is some hilarious stuff, like the ones I'll show you right now. Oh no. This one works. This map it wasn't especially good though. Oh, I talked too soon! No! No, 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 no! No! Oh, fuck! Something's on fire. What's that? No! So, that's pretty much what Dixper does. It affects your gameplay, but it doesn't it doesn't mess with your game per se. It messes with your screen and your sound, your keyboard and your mouse. Some things are game engine changing, but it's very, very few stuff, very, very little stuff. Uh, so, and everything reverts back to normal after the skill, as it's called, is done. So, next thing, you gotta go to your widgets. You can activate an alert box as all other alerts, stream elements, stream labs, whatever. You choose, like, okay, how it's gonna look when someone does stuff in my stream. And it's gonna look like this, and it's gonna come up a little text. And I can actually, just to show you how that looks, I'll send a test alert to my OBS right now. There we go, Richard Hendricks is gonna mess with you three times. And that's how the alerts look, you add them in like any other alert, you copy this uh, this web address here, uh, press the copy to clipboard over here, right click in your scene in OBS, add and add as a browser source. It's easy as that. And then you can also set up a bot that has some timers you can set up, I have mine that tells my followers and viewers that I'm, start, that I'm using Dixper and sends them a link to check it out. You can also have your own special commands in Dixper. Uh, although I have not tried this out as much because it just delivers messages and I mainly use stream elements to do that for me already. Also, you register your payment. It says total paid zero because I'm a fucking nobody. Nobody buys my stuff, so don't, ma don't care about that. But you'll get paid. You can see you are a streamer. Complete achievements to get a new role. 
My plan is at 70%. This is the lowest plan, which means if someone buys crates from Dixper for $10, you get $7. And this goes up to 90 at the highest plan, which I think it's a lot better than Twitch. Twitch takes 50% of everything. And that's just bullshit. Then you get this link. I would be very happy if you use my link to register for Dixper, which I will put in the description below so that you yourself can start using it right away. It's really fun. Um, I have given away some crates just to get it started to some of my more concurrent viewers. And it's really fun. It gives hilarious results. And I really hope that you'll consider using this for your own stream. And when it comes to connecting with OBS and stuff, as soon as you open OBS and you have Dixper open, you're going to get this synced thing that is right behind my camera here. Uh, so let me just turn that off for a while so you can see it. There we go. Here is the synced thing. That means OBS is on. And this one, you can select your games here. Uh, these are the games I've played while having Dixper running. And you have to choose them in this add game list. It's gonna pop up as a window. You choose it and the next time you start the game, it's gonna link it automatically, but the first time you have to do it yourself on this select game button. And after that's done, I'll just show you what happens if someone like goes into your Dark Skills, Dark Souls Trilogy skills, and then you get like, someone wants to really fuck with you, so they turn your world upside down. They send this skill, takes a couple of seconds, and then BAM, it sends it. And you see? It doesn't become upside down as in actual upside down it becomes the upside down from stranger things but there is also a skill that actually flips over your monitor you just have to find it here it is supposed to be somewhere where is it let's see oh like this one open a tunnel of terror that's a good one you can see what it does now it's gonna do a lot of bullshit to me like this and that really messes with you and there's a sound as well uh, I'm not sure I think you can hear it but I'm not sure and yeah you you get you get the gif you get the idea the idea is mainly fuck with me while I stream really screw me over please don't report me for saying bad words to YouTube uh, because I don't want that. <laughs> and you can also create your own skills like this. Create or import skill. Create your customizable skill. And let's, let's like... Uh, let's see. Uh, device manipulation. Manipulate the screen. Here we go. Rotate screen. This is so easy, okay? It's going to rotate the screen. Let's pump this up to about 20 seconds. Save it. And then launch it. Three, two, one, and bam. Okay, you can't see it because I'm not in a game. That's why it doesn't work. But it's gonna flip the screen upside down. Trust me, I've done this a hundred times. It is no issue with this one whatsoever. Uh, just remember to run this software as an administrator, or it's not gonna work. Uh, some things work without administrator rights, but taking over your keyboard and mouse is not gonna work while not being an admin. So that is Dixper. That's how it works with you and you connect via Twitch. You don't need an, any separate accounts. You add your uh, PayPal to it and you can get money from it. You can also use my link down here below and you get $5 right away. You use my link, I get $5, and you get $5, everybody wins. And it's free to use as a streamer, you never have to pay Dixper, because the payments come from the customers buying the crates to use on your stream. So guys, I hope you really, really, really like that, and I will be back again with another video sometime in a week or so. I'm trying to do this every week, it's really hard, but I'm live on Twitch Monday to Friday from 7am to 9am. Uh, European Standard Time, that means it's about 1 a.m. Uh, Eastern Time and uh, 11 p.m. Western Time in the U.S. So just come check me out, subscribe to my YouTube, 
and come hang out with me and talk all you want. I really like you guys. Cheers, everyone.